well, when I first out of college, I went to work and I feel like I want to do something more. Like I want to make completely new product. I just, I don't want to, to be a quality control kind of person with, you know, checking the quality of the products, which was the, my first job. So it's like, I want to make some new product. I don't want to, to you know, this is boring. So that's why you go on and study more and then go into product development. That's kind of my short story. <laughs> it's a little bit more uh, downstream. So it's more involved with process and uh, how the new product go into different process, different converter, different, uh, you know, our product go into different kind of material, different uh, process at the different manufacturers. I think that would be a very fulfilling kind of feeling when you go out on a market and you see the product that you help make it. Go on the market and you see, oh, that's the cutting board. You know, we we, we have the additive and I help make the additive going with that. And that would be uh, kind of a, a proud moment. <laughs> I think the biggest challenge when you talk about microbial growth on the surface is that you don't normally see it um, because they are too small for you to see. So when you actually see it, you know, like if it already changed color, already smelly, already have, you know, thing that you can take pictures and see, it's, it's already too far gone. You can cannot do anything to reverse the process. So uh, when customer come up and, or some people say, oh, my stuff got, you know, things grow in it. What can I do now? There's pretty much nothing you can done. You can, you can do at that time. So, uh, and how to communicate that to the customer, the consumer that you've got to prevent it from happening before you can see it. It's kind of, mm, I, I would say it's a challenge, challenging phase, but I think that the consumer is, is uh, getting um, you know, more information and knowledge and, and more understanding of it now. Reading, read a lot of, um, like magazine, like the fake fake magazine, and uh, a lot of that going to do with like you browsing the website for you know, shopping websites. Uh, you go to the supermarket and see you know what's there, how, how's people reacted, um, and then uh, on the professional side is attending a technical show, and you see okay how. Um, the regulatory landscape has changed how people use what the new process going on, new material coming on on the market, things like that. So that's kind of two way that I keep things up to date on my side. I would say Personally, I would see if I am as the consumer, I would need the product. Do I need the product as the consumer or not? Uh, if I might say I want to go out and buy okay, um, the phone case that treated with antimicrobial, then I would say a lot of people would have some kind of similar idea, you know, 
Um, so I'm thinking about myself at consumer first. That's the thing. Um, and then, of course, I rely on the marketing team and the sales team on the information that when they talk to their customer, um, the, that's all the voice of the customer that I'm going to hear from. So that's, that's kind of where I'm coming from. A lot of the antifungal on the market is relatively uh, nasty. Um, we came from a period with not much of information or, 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 or knowledge about how um, some of the additives, some of the old generation additive impact the environment. So MicroGuard is the new line of product in the new directions that um, having much less impact on the environment and uh, with the much better toxicology profile. So I think I'm really excited about it. Actually, the challenge we give ourselves, um, how can we find and improve less hazardous actives that are you know, more user friendly and have better toxicology profile? So you know, that kind of where we were. Uh, the need to work with reliable supplier who can stand by the products and support you in the manufacturing process. Um, I think that's that's a very important thing. So just first, if you need antimicrobial, if you want to work with a reliable supplier um, that can you know, stand by the product in terms of regulatory marketing, um, uh, qualities, and they can support you in the manufacturing process. I'm excited because microgas is, I would say, of all the antifungal product line on the market, we would build this as a very uh, it's much better toxicology profile. And hopefully, you know, get more as consumer get more educated about the material, the products, um, they will choose Michael Garth. So 